problem. The cable supported at A and D at the same level or a span of 30 meter is loaded as shown in figure. So determine the maximum segment of the cable. So cable, it is supported at A and D. There are at A and D, it is hinge support. Okay. So at A, it is hinge support. So that's why there are two reactions. One, it is horizontal. And second one, it is vertical. Okay. So vertical reaction, we call it is AY. And horizontal reaction, we call it is AX. Okay. So write down this unit is AX. Okay. AX. So now at B it is in support. That's why there is here it is also there are two reactions. One it is BX in horizontal direction, it is BX in vertical direction, it is B1. In vertical direction, it is B1. Okay. B1. Okay. So now write down. From similar triangle, from similar triangle, similar triangle, from similar triangle. So just consider this triangle. From similar triangle, just we consider this triangle. So this, this is first triangle. Okay. So for first triangle, four by three, it is four divided by four divided by three. Four divided by three is equal to is equal to. So this distance we just consider it will be y d. Okay. So y d ten. So this total four plus six it is ten divided by y d. 10 divided by y d. Okay. This is from the similar triangle. 10 divided by y d. Okay. So from this relation, it will get y d. Y d is equal to just put y d is equal to y d is equal to 10 into 3 by 4. 3 by 4. It will get 7.5. So y d is equal to 7.5. 5 meter. Okay. So this distance is y d is equal to 1.5 meter. Okay. Let's try down this one. This y d distance. Okay. So now apply condition of equilibrium for entire cable. For entire cable. For entire cable. So first apply First equilibrium equation that is summation fx is equal to zero. Algebraic sum of all the horizontal forces. Summation fx is equal to zero. So for that assumption, the direction of force it is right side. It will be take positive. Direction of force it is right side. It will be take positive. Positive. The direction of force it is left side. It will be take negative. The direction of force it is left side. It will be take negative. Okay. It will be take negative. So, which are the force it is in horizontal direction? C X. One it is A X and second one it is B X. So, A X it is going left side so, and B X it is going right side. So, A X it is minus A X because it is going left side. Then B X it is going right side plus B X is equal to 0. So, from this relation it will get A X is equal to B X. A X is equal to bx bx okay. x is equal to bx so this one is equation number one this one is equation number one this one is equation number one so now next apply the equation that is summation f y is equal to j summation f y is equal to 0. So for that, the direction of force it is upward, it will take positive. The direction of force it is upward, it will be positive. The direction of force it is downward, it will be negative. 
direction of positive downwards, it will be negative. Okay. First, a y it is going upward direction, and b y it is also going upward direction, and at c ten kilometer it is going downward, and fifteen kilometer it is downward. So a y and b y it is positive, and ten and fifteen it is negative. So a y then plus b y it is going upward. So this one it is also positive, and at c ten kilometer it is going downward, so minus ten. At d it is fifteen kilometer it is going downward, so minus fifteen is equal to G is equal to G. So from this relation, it will get A Y plus B Y is equal to 25 kilonewton. 25 kilonewton. Okay. Write down this one is equation number two. This one is equation number two. Okay. This one is write down equation number two. Equation number two. So now apply next equilibrium equation that is summation moment at a is equal to zero. Take at moment at a or b. So I will take it moment at a is equal to zero. So for that assumption, I will consider if the moment it is clockwise direction, it will be take negative. Moment it is clockwise direction, it will be negative. The moment it is anti-clockwise direction, it will take positive. We take positive. Okay. First of all, take it start from A to C. So A it is acted all this force it is zero. At C it is C. How it is rotation C? It is clockwise direction. So it is negative. And perpendicular distance it is this one. It is C to A perpendicular distance. This one it is C to A perpendicular distance means this one at this distance. So it will be eight meter. So so. Minus 10 into 8. Then next one it is 15 kilometer. See here, this one it is also rotation about the clockwise direction. So clockwise direction it is negative. Then perpendicular distance it is see here, this one it is d to a distance. So how much is d to a? So see here, this distance 12 plus 8 is 20 meter. Okay, so minus. Minus 15 into 20. 15 into 20. Then next one it is is bx it is 0. It is no perpendicular distance for a bx and ax. So now by. So by how it is rotation? This one it is rotation anti-clockwise direction. So anti-clockwise direction it is positive. So b to a distance, this one it is b to a distance. So 4, 6, 4 plus 6, 10, 10 plus 12, it is 22, 22 plus 8, 30. Total distance, it is 30. Right now, plus B, Y into 30 is equal to 0, is equal to 0. So from this relation, it will get B, Y is equal to, B, Y is equal to. So minus 10 into 8, then minus 15 into 20, Take it is right side, it will get plus 3, 380 divided by 30. So it will 12.67 kilometer. 12.67 kilo newton. So this one it is B by value. Okay. This one it is B by value. So now apply. Next. Now consider BD part. Consider BD, BD or AC part. So I will consider BD part. BD part. Okay. So consider only BD part. B to D. Okay. So only we consider this part only. Okay. Only this part. Okay. From this right side part. Okay. This part only. So for considering BD part. Take moment at D is equal to 0. Take at moment summation of moment at D is equal to 0. And D is equal to 0. Okay. So we are taking moment at D. So take it is only right part. So by into perpendicular distance. So by height, how it is rotation about the D? Here, this is rotation about the D. It is in 
which direction? It is in clockwise direction. So, sorry, anti-clockwise direction. Just see it. So this one it is rotation. Anti-clockwise direction. V1. Okay. So perpendicular distance V2 D. This distance it is 10 meter. Okay. 10 meter. So write down. Here it is also same assumption. So clockwise it will be negative. For anti-clockwise it will be positive. For anti-clockwise it will be positive. For anti-clockwise it will be positive. Okay. It will be positive. So write down by. So it is how it is rotation by it is about the D C L. This one it is anti-clockwise direction rotation. Anti-clockwise. So anti-clockwise direction it is positive. So by by into perpendicular distance it is 10. Then next one it is bx. See here, bx it is how it is rotation bx it is clockwise direction. Bx it is rotation clockwise direction. So clockwise direction it is negative so minus minus bx into perpendicular distance. See here, for bx perpendicular distance this one. This one it is this distance yd distance this distance yd it is 7.5 meter 7.5 meter so into 7.5 5 is equal to g so by value we are calculated by it is 12.67 just put here 12.67 into 10 then minus bx into 7.5 7.5 is equal to g okay so from this relation it will get bx so right on, bx is equal to bx is equal to 12.67 into 10 divided by 7.5. So it will be 16.89 kilo. 16.89 kilo newton. Okay. So this one it is bx value. So now from equation one, what we got ax is equal to bx. So that's why ax it is also same value. So ax is equal to it is 16.89 kilo newton. 16.89 kilo newton. So this it is x value okay so now what is question determine the maximum segment in the cable maximum tension okay. so b by it is how much 12.67 and a by it is so we need to calculate a y it is also so right on a y is equal to a y is equal to so a y plus b y is equal to 25 kilo 25 minus 12.67 from this relation it will get a y value so a y is equal to 12.33 kilo newton okay 12.33 kilo so this one it is a y value okay so now b y it is greater than a y okay because b b y value it is 12.67 and a y it is 12.33 so maximum tension maximum tension will be will be in cable will be in cable b d in cable b d okay so write down maximum tension in the cable bd t max is equal to or t b d is equal to t b d is equal to t b d is equal to root of root of root of root of root of bx square bx square bx square bx square plus plus by square plus by square plus by square plus by square plus by square, plus by square. just put all this value bx square it is 
root of root of dx square it is 16.89 square plus by plus by square it is 12.67 12.67 square 12.67 square so from this relation it will be t max t max is equal to t max is equal to t bd is equal to i know still with 16.89 square plus 12.67 square root of answer still with 21.11 kilometer 20 21.11 kilo newton from this relation it will get t max and t okay so this is maximum tension in cable bd that is question determine the maximum segment of the cable so maximum segment in the cable bd it is that is t max it is 21.11 kilo this is your final answer okay